everyone. Thanks so much for coming back to my channel. This is Tina with Tina's Craft Creations. I'm on today with a um, unboxing of my Halloween um, boo camp um, swap that I received from Renee Vanette. Um, now, if you are more not part of the boo camp for um, the month of October that was hosted by Rachel and Fleur, Basically, um, there was an option if you wanted to sign up for a swap, and those of us who decided to do that, um, we were just paired up randomly, so um, Renee, I guess, got my name. She's from Canada. It just came today. Today's November 2nd, so it's a little late, unfortunately, but still, it's really close to Halloween, so I'm excited to see what she sent me, and it was in this massive box, too. She sent me a lot here, so she definitely went above and beyond what we were um, supposed to send, so Renee, if you are watching my video. Thank you so much. I'm super excited to see what you made for me and I'm just going to go ahead and get into it. So the first couple things she sent me are some trims. It looks like these came from Michael's. This is a, I think the Halloween trim that came out this year with the like brighter colors that they released. Super cute little pumpkins. And then this one has, it's white with little black spiders. Sorry if I'm not focusing. Super cute trim. So I've got that. Thank you so much, Renee. She also put in this cute little um, tie, um, like a beanie belly, um, little pumpkin guy. <laughs> His name is Hollow. It says, trick or treat time is here. The best day of the year. I'm as friendly as can be smiling for you all to see. My birthday is August 25th. <laughs> all right. So thank you so much for that. That is adorable. A little beanie belly. All right. She also included some stickers. And these are like... Um, kind of like dimensional. They're like puffy-ish stickers. I don't know how to describe it, but they're really fun. There's a little owl, a little cauldron, kitty cats. That one looks like a bottle cap with a spider on it. A little headstone, a little witch, another owl, witch flying her broom, another little bottle. I like that candelabra with the bat on it. Super fun stickers. And I like how they have that dimension to them. So fun. Very, very cool. I wonder if these came from Dollarama. I've never been to Dollarama. It's in Canada. I really want to go. I just think it would be so fun. <laughs> All right, so I'm just going to grab it random. We have another package here. She included this little um, orange bag with um, some like velvet spider webs on it, and she's got some package, some things in here for me. So look at this cool bag. It's it's super fun. Cannot wait to reuse that. All right, so in this package, she included something here. And this is a larger package, too, so I don't know what she made, what she sent me or made. Oh, fun! She made me a bunch of embellishments. Okay, so the first one, we have some handmade flowers, and I love how she did the little googly eyes in the center. Those are so fun. So fun. I cannot wait to use these next year. I love those. Okay, she also made me, oh, and I like how she used the ribbon with the spiders and the rickrack trim as, like, a little bag topper. So fun. Okay, and then these are some little, um, like, banner strips with um, some fun, again, some trims as the bag topper. So she's got, we'll just cut one of here. Let me see if I can get this. My fingers do not want to work today. <laughs> here we go. These cute little thing, uh, little embellishments with the, um, they're like little flag banners. She's got little bead dangles on the end. I love the little candy corn. Um, there was like some glitter in here, so it's all over everything, which is so fun. I love this little bead here. It looks almost like, yeah, okay, it looks like an eyeball. Yeah, sort of like an eyeball. That's really fun. And, and I think this was a die. I can't remember who came out with it, but she's also added some Heishi beads on this one, a little kitty cat, trims on all of them, which is a great use of trims, eyelash trim and things like that, little bats, little be uh, seed bead dangles. These are so fun. Love those little embellishments. I know I don't have this particular die, but I mean, you can make little banner strips like that fairly easily without a die. Super cute. So, so cute. All right, she's also made me some little, um, like, straw, like, flag embellishments. Uh, actually, I'm not going to take these out because this is going to be a long video. These are so cute. I love how she's got, like, the different arrows pointing different ways, like, Spooky Street that way, Tricks that way, Witches Lair that way, Treats that way, Haunted Mansion that way. So fun. And then again, she's used Rick Rack, um, or, like, a trim as her uh, bag topper. 
Super cute. Love these. And then she also made this one, which is like a waterfall effect. Look at this bag topper. Oh my gosh, I love the little kitty cat mummy. I think that's from the new, um, or the American Crafts uh, Halloween collection. And then another little kitty cat behind that. So again, some more trims, some little flag banners. She's got some rosettes in here. This one has some little witch's feet hanging out with her little witch hat out the, down at the bottom. October 31st with some candy, some tool. And then there's like a, a patterned paper rosette in the back. And then this one we have a little rosette with some tool on it. And then like a little die cut doily kind of thing with some little bats. And it says batty for you. So cute. And then we have this one that says creepy crawler with the little spider. So fun. I love these. Thank you so much, Renee. And she also included some pencils. And I love how she did this as a bag topper. This really fun little house. I'll talk about paper piecing on that. That is so cute. With the little fence and the windows and the door. And then all of the little like boards like they're broke are like leaning to and from. And then like a, a, a creepy tree. That is so cool. I'm going to hopefully be able to reuse this. Love those pencils too. Those are so fun. Thank you so much. All right. We still have a bunch of things thing, things though. So hang tight, you guys. I gotta get to get the next package. All right. So we have this little bag here with some little kitty cats on it. Definitely will reuse this as well. You guys know I'm a, I love kitty cats. I have three of them myself. How fun is that little bag? I know Rachel would like this too because she's got a black cat. So fun. All right, so in here we have this. She's got it all wrapped up. Okay, what did she include in here? She's got it really well wrapped, so I don't know if it's something that's breakable. Oh, cute, she made me an embellishment box. Okay, cool. I have actually never used any of these little round um, embellishment boxes, but she's made this as like a belly band, and then I love how she did the doily with a rosette and then some... Um, tool glued onto the back of this spider web and then she's added these ephemera pieces that is so fun and such a good idea for these round ones yeah so cute oh it's not an embellishment box it's a sequin box how fun like a like a lime green then we have orange this really pretty like pinky purple color black a shiny metallic lime green, metallic orange, metallic purple, and like a matte black. How fun. I love this. That's such a good idea for these too. Thank you so much. This is so cute. I love it. I love this little box. So cute. All right. So we have a couple more things to unwrap. She's got this one here. All right, what did she send me in this one? There's like a glassine envelope in here. Oh, cute. Oh my gosh, this is so adorable. Oh my gosh, look at this. Look at all these layers. Oh my gosh, look at, is this? It's a card. No way. That is so cool. She's got so many layers on here to create this, like, dimensional card. Like, are you seeing all these layers? This is so cute. There's no way I'm going to be able to give this to someone. <laughs> this is getting displayed in my craft room, like, year-round. This is the coolest card. Oh, my gosh. I love it. That is... Oh, my gosh. I cannot even imagine how long it took you to make this. How cool. What a fun little scene. And, of course, I love the kitty cat. That is so cute. I just can't get over all these layers. That is so, so cool. And she's got so many layers of foam. So everything is popped up. I can't believe this is a card. This is so cool. And then obviously this is the envelope for it. But I'm going to be displaying this in my craft room. That is a work of art. It's so cute. So, so cute. Okay, we have a couple more things. We have this one here, this like, iridescent bag with this black and white trim, which I'm totally going to keep. 
I have this like jar that I keep like scrap trim in. This is gonna go in there, that's so fun. All right, so in here, she created like a little book, I think maybe like a flip book. Let's see. Yeah, she was definitely working with that American Crafts Halloween collection. Okay, so here on the front, there's like a little tuck spot. It's like a vel um a vellum. I can't think, I can't think of the word today. Vellum little pocket, which she has these little tags tucked into, and she's added twine to all of these, and then added little jemmies for the skeleton. How cute. And then on this, oh, up here, oh, I love, I just love that cat paper. Here, on, there's also more tags here, so they're tucked into the side. And then this here with, like, the little eye, like eyeballs peeking out of, the black, out of the darkness. Another little tag. And then we have this. This opens, and you have another little tuck spot here. And she's added this here. This is so cool. Oh my gosh, and then this is like a vellum pocket. Yeah, this is, okay, so this is like a little vellum tuck, tuck spot where she has added these little ticket, or like a little ticket embellishment. Yeah, okay, so it's just one. She's glued them together. How cute. And then on here she's glued like little pumpkin sequins, a little spider sequins, a little kitty cat, that pumpkin and spider again. How adorable. This is just so cute. She's added a little skeleton, two little skeletons dancing there. Okay, and this opens into a, a further into a little book. Yeah, this could totally be used as like a little album because she's got like, these are like photo spots. Um, you can put photos on here, photo mats. How cute. She's made this little pocket a shaker and added a little um, coffin with little bats and a skull and crossbones. And then these little matting pieces here. Of course, I love the one with the little kitty cat the most. And then in the middle, she's added these two little um, like photo mats with little fancy little corners. And then there's a fancy tag in the in the pocket. Oh, cool! There's like all these different little Halloween scenes on these like little banners, like little um, almost like Polaroid banners. There's like kitty cats and witches and pumpkins. How fun! And then, oh, she's stapled on some trim. A little striped one, and then the other side is the spider trim. This is so cool! Oh my gosh, Renee, thank you so much! I love this. It's so cool. And then on the back, there's another pot. Is there another pocket? Oh yeah, yeah, it flips! Okay, cool. So it has a little tab, and it flips down, and it, you can obviously put another picture here. And another picture here. This is a fun little flip album. Oh my gosh, I love this. Thank you so much. I'm going to have to get some Halloween pictures printed. This is so fun. Love this. Thank you so much. Love, love, love. All right, and we have one more package, which is huge as well. Okay, so what do we have in here? So we have... Oh my gosh, she sent me a bunch of candy. <laughs> Holy cow, so many candies. All right, a giant um, package of Skittles. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. I'm so sorry to cough on the video. A giant thing of Skittles. We have some mini M&Ms. Okay, we also have some popping candy, like a giant container. Two, three giant containers. We have raspberry, green apple, and strawberry. And I'm guessing these are like the... Um, Oh, it's like, is it like a lollipop? Like a popping candy lollipop? That's fun. These are probably like Pop Rocks, but they're like lollipops. How cool. I cannot wait to try those. And then she also sent me these lollipops, which are like little candy swirls in the Halloween colors and tied them with the, more of that little trim. And then she's included some double bubble gum which makes the whole package smell like bubble gum. It smells so fun. It really does. It smells like bubble gum. It's so nice. So some bubble, double bubble. And then she's also included some little rockets. Now, rockets in Canada are what we have as Smarties here. These are called Smarties in the U.S. But they're literally the same thing. But they're called rockets in Canada. And I love Smarties. Like the American Smarties. They're like this kind of candy. And... 
the Canada Smarties are like M and M's. It's like a you know non labeled M and M, like a candy shell chocolate kind of candy. So that is everything. Oh my gosh, Renee. I, I hope that you check. I hope you watch my channel because this is an amazing um, swap. Thank you so much. I love it. It was absolutely worth the wait. I cannot wait to display these things in my craft room and use these embellishments next year. Thank you so so much. I love it. I had so much fun participating in boot camp, and I cannot wait to participate in Rachel and Fleur's next um, class, which is coming up in a couple of weeks for like Happy Mail, and um, it's just they're having such like fun classes. So. I'm super excited to participate in that one as well. But this one was really, really fun. And I'm so excited that I got this awesome package. Renee, thank you. Thank you so much. I love everything. You are the best. Have a great day, everyone. If you have any questions, let me know. And if you've not already, I'd greatly appreciate if you would consider subscribing. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.